All right, y'all. I just got back from the, the the tackle shop and the different store. You know what I mean? And they actually had a couple of the logs left, and so I just took them logs without paying for them, cause that's how hillbillies do it. Yes, yeah, Siberia. I, I got three pouches of Siberia at work. It's got me buzzing like crazy, man. It's not good stuff. I might have to call in sick. What I usually gotta do is I gotta take off the weekend from work and put in Siberia because it really helps me relax. You know what I'm saying? That and, you know, some of that other stuff I like, you know, because real hicks, real hicks, uh, eat the Siberia. Okay, they don't chew it, they eat it. The Siberia is what you gotta have in order to be a hick in the sticks in 2020. Because us hillbillies out here don't know what it's like to live in the city and we really don't care because that's not where we're from and that's not a heritage because hicks and sticks live their own life and they can't keep sitting around and letting the skull and the copenhagen companies push them around because i choose siberia okay Yeah, they're, okay, yeah. Yeah, that's like, the Siberia is good. It really helps me sleep at night. <laughs> if I put in a full... <coughs> I put in a full stadium right after I brush my teeth. And I just sit back on the couch. Just let it soak it up. The big old couch with my soulmate. With the Siberia on my lip. It helps a lot every time. One time, I was driving down the road. I was up in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, okay? And I was driving down the road, and some of the rednecks I was cruising with with a beat up pickup truck. And told me to put it in a horseshoe. And I slapped that baby in, and I. Kept on cruising a good five minutes down the road and I started, started you know, coughing it up. Now I tried to find a <laughs> cup right beside me. So I grabbed that old small little styrofoam cup and just started, it, it actually, uh, I started like vomiting in the cup. As I was passing a Harrisburg, the city of Harrisburg police officer. And I was like, oh no. And then the person beside me told me to speed up and I just took off running. I outrun the police like I always do because I don't I I don't give in to no police. That's the way I do it. You know, I do my own thing, my own way, every single day of my life. I don't give it up. I don't give it up, not not for anyone, not for no one. Unless it's another hillbilly because I'm true and I'm legit. I need you to know, everyone on my social media, I need them to know that I'm legit. Okay, I need you to know that. I'll be there. <laughs> Sorry, the side barrier is starting to get to me again. I just want you to know that when you're on your deathbed, I'll be the one that's there for you. I'm there, I'm 100% legit. All day, every day, I need you there. I'm true, not fake, okay? I'm legit, I'll be there for you. I'll be at you on your deathbed, cause I'm legit. Oh. So like I was saying, Cause I'm legit and not many people are. Most people are city people, not me. I'm legit, I'm Earl Stibble Jr. I mean, I'm the country boy who puts a dip in every day. 
I wake up, put a dip in, put my overalls on, I sing the country boy song. That's just who I am, okay? I'll be there with you on your deathbed. And I have a list, I have a list written down for those who are fake. And when I get coronavirus, I know who I'm coughing on. I know it and I'm gonna cough right on them, right away, as soon as I get it. I ain't holding back, I ain't playing. You know who you're talking to? I ain't playing. That's what I'm gonna say to him. You know what I'm saying? I ain't playing with you. I'll be like, back off, back off me. You like your face. I said, do you like your face? That's what I'll be saying to the person in the deathbed after I cough on them with coronavirus. Well, anyway, my dip's starting to get sick and I'm getting me sick here. I might have to take a nap, maybe relax a little bit, put another dip in. Maybe put a horseshoe or maybe a full stadium. I'm feeling really wild tonight. That's what I'll be doing. All right. Until next time, keep it real with the real OGs. The hillbillies from the hills. <laughs>